Welcome back to the show. We're in conversation with Mary Walsh. What a treasure. Thank you for being here. Well, thank you for having me. <laughs> you treasure muffin. Now, I want to talk about your latest work, The Misses Downstairs. What's that about? Well, you know, Dave Sullivan, who's a brilliant guy, who actually did a lot of work for Tourism in Newfoundland, those ads that make us think even if we're in Newfoundland, gosh, I wish I was there. Right. Yeah, that Newfoundland. The mysterious that is. Narnia Newfoundland. Yeah, yeah, with all the redheaded kids and everything. <laughs> but anyway, helping us to, to, to see the beauty of where we are, right? But anyway, so he has been working, uh, I think he's working, but anyway, he did something on um, on Facebook that was these series of vignettes that I just loved and other people loved them too. And I reached out to Dave and said, you know, I love the, I love them. I would think I was born to be the Mrs. Downstairs and, and you were born obviously to be you and let's get together. We had lunch and, and then we went on. We um, Five actually was Ruth Lawrence, who's been a... A, a fantastic person in in this province and in and 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 in this uh, city. Um, I just have to mention Ruth. Uh, do you mind mm, if I do this? Let's do it. it like when uh, when Snowmageddon happened, you know, and people were trapped in their homes and couldn't get out, and it was before the National Guard showed up. Ruth organized a bunch of people, a bunch of other women, to get together and shovel people out. So all you had to do was on Facebook, you could Facebook Ruth and say, I'm trapped down on, you know, uh, Brazel Square. I don't guess Brazel Square doesn't even exist anymore. <laughs> and she would, she would teach. DM you and, and then get all these people together to... Now that's remarkable. Isn't that Newfoundlanders remarkable? Helping God Newfoundlanders. love her. And anyway, she Ruth. knew about Five TV and how they had were spending some money on the arts. And I thought, well, Dave and I just want to do this because we love it. We love this. And so Ruth put us in touch with uh, the people at Bell. And, and uh, in fact, we did it. And it was like one of those things that it just easily rolled out. There was no... Oh my God, I hate them! And you know, like it was just like, and we ended up shooting it in Cachuzas, which is one of my favorite places. And the sun shone for us those 10 days. And uh, and so it just came on on Monday. And uh, on Five One, or if you have the uh, Five something, something, you know. <laughs> let, Check something. it out. The Miss yeah. is downstairs, though. Yeah. Easily yeah. Googleable and checkable on Facebook. We're almost out of time already. Oh. Do you have 30 seconds of final thoughts for our viewers out there? All I want to say is I'm just so grateful to have gotten older, you know, and, and to have had the, the privilege of getting older because life does change and all the things that are just killing you in your 40s and 50s, like, you know, being trapped in that sandwich kind of uh, time between your children and all that passes and... And, and it's like you just think, you know, it isn't like old age isn't what they said it was going to be, like, a, you know, a terrible going through the valley of death towards some, you know, as you lose time, you also gain perspective on how important time is and what you want to do with it. And, and I am just so grateful to have had the life that I've had. And I never thought that I would ever get to that point because I was always like, oh yeah, this, but I should be having that, you know, like, <laughs> so, uh, you know, a lot of time wasted and just so grateful to be here.